I'm Siska Verwoord, Dutch-born Australian citizen since I was six years of age, yeah. I'm from Holland. I lived in a little place called Leerdam and I came out when I was six with my family. We thought that uh, Europe was basically f***ed and there'd be another third world war. So everyone was out of there when they could be. And we got these people from Australia showing us these wonderful films about beaches and sunshine. And it'd been pretty cruel for the years before. So we were in like Flynn. It was fabulous. I work in oil on canvas. I've tried uh, acrylics, but it, for me it's like chewing gum. I just can't use it. And I spend a hell of a lot of money on my paints because I think using the best quality pigments is terribly important. It makes it so much easier. I have been making art since childhood. As a, as a kid, I, I filled exercise books full of flowers and insects. But then I started buying art books as soon as I got some money at 14. I'd buy art books and I'd start copying the masters, mainly Vachoch and Renoir, the Impressionists. And then I started to exhibit in 1970 when I was 21. On and off for years, I've been, you know, I've had probably 50 or 60 exhibitions, shared and, and singular. Since I've been living in the Otways and at Apollo Bay, my whole uh, visual dictionary has changed. I've become uh, much more preoccupied with horizons and you know, landscape, seascape, and um, changed enormously. To me, the subject really isn't that important. Um, the end result isn't even that important. I start in a very loose way, and if it looks like a landscape, it'll be a landscape, but if it looks like a garden, and it isn't only at that stage after I've got down my first layers of very roughly thrown paint, that I then start to focus and see the images that I want to paint. But for me, it's all about the smell and the color, and you know, it's the experience. I, I remember someone saying in one of my earlier exhibitions, about 10 years ago, he was a, a journalist, and he said, Siska, I want to ask you, what are you on? Because your colours look like you're on something. A lot of people can't take it, but if you're like me and you're a high, you're a high octane personality, then you probably would also like the colourings. Uh, I love music. I just listen to the classics, and you know, when you're painting, Pink Floyd, you know, nothing makes the the brush move faster and with more energy than Pink Floyd. You sort of get into this. Um, uh, space. It's, it's, as I said to you earlier, it's like meditation, music and painting. It could, however, be the sniff of turpentine that's getting to me. <laughs> I don't know. It's fun.